What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video, deuces. Um, in this video, I'm going to be sharing my recent acquisition, which is the GWG 2000 Modmaster. I mean, god damn, guy. This thing right here is a freaking powerhouse. This is by far the best Modmaster that I've ever had. And, uh, yeah really impressed with it um, but recently I had the GB 100 um, and I've been rocking this for uh, the last couple of weeks um, I love it it's very comfortable the only thing about it is the sizing on this it feels like it's a size too big uh, for my wrist uh, and, and, and what I mean with this is it feels like the size is just one size too big because if I leave one hole out it's like uh, a little bit too loose and if I put it all the way in uh, with the hole that is one uh, step closer it's too tight so it's like shit it has to be like right in the middle so that's the only gripe i have with this other than that it really doesn't bother me that much and also that this sucker right here i try to put the light a little bit better this sucker right here is not solar guys and uh yeah that kind of aggravates me a little bit um because uh i like i like the solar uh option i'm not one of those people that i like uh changing batteries all the goddamn time you know what i'm saying i think that's very annoying and uh i don't like doing that at all focus yeah there you go all right so this was the gb100 awesome great value for your money very rugged watch Am amazing powerhouse what i got now holy damn this g-shock right here guys the gwg 2000 i mean it has everything that i like it's totally rugged i like the color i like the 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 the, the green and yellow I like uh, the carbon fiber. I like the, the the beautiful dial with the with the yellow. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to. Yeah, with the yellow uh, marker over there. It has a compass. It has a triple sensor. It's a multi-band six, and it's solar. I mean what else do you need i have all the alarm functions to every every um, alarm that i need which is five o'clock in the morning 12 15 when i'm preparing to go pick up my granddaughter uh 12 56 when i need to pick up my daughter and 4 15 where i need to start get rolling again uh to go pick up uh, my daughter uh from from her school events um, so it has all the alarm features that I need. Uh, I like the fact that I don't have to change the battery, that it's a solar. Uh, it's rugged. I love the carbon fiber. I don't know if you guys can see that. I mean, look at the, the detail on that. It's just beautiful. The carbon fiber. Amazing. Um, it's very thin compared to this one so you can see there's a significant difference right there in, in thickness the GB100 is significantly uh, thicker than the GWG2000 um, there's mm, almost the same um, weight to it what I absolutely love about this is the sapphire crystal. Very beautiful. Very shiny. The bezel. 
I'm not sure what material the bezel is, but it's very, it's like metal and shiny. I'm not sure what type of material, material it is, but uh, beautiful. Um, the world time, let's go over the functions right now. So it just has, it has just your regular timing, your regular time, it has your barometer, it has your temperature, right now it's in measuring 27 uh, degrees, it has your recall, it has your stopwatch, your alarm, sorry, your timer, this is your timer, then it has alarm, it has a few of them, uh, the world time, right now I have the world time on Holland, so it will go to the Netherlands time, right there, you guys see it? And then it has the remote, the RC. So this is where it goes to multiband, and it can uh, hook up to a tower and get the right, the right hour. And then it goes back to just your regular time. Very beautiful. Uh, let me put the light off here so you can see the loom. On this is just impeccable. Turn this light off too. It's very, very bright. It's very, 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 very bright. Now it does have loom as well. So hold on, guys. Let me try. And this is the loom. I'm not sure how long the loom will stay um, like this, but the loom is pretty bright. I'm pretty sure it will. It could stay on like that the whole night, I'm pretty sure. Um, but, of course, the light itself is just badass. Just badass. Um, so, again, I picked this up for an amazing deal. Uh, this GWG... 2000 these watches are not cheap. I think they go for about 500 600 700 depending on uh, where they retail uh, They're definitely They're definitely a beautiful one that's for sure and uh, I was lucky enough to pick this up at a very very good deal and uh, I had to snag it up but a very very beautiful mud master mud masters in general are awesome watches and uh, yeah i have nothing negative to say about uh, neither of them except for this one the it's not solar and it's just mm, like a size has a weird size it's not too small and it's not too big talk about these holes uh, I, I think I would have need one that's like right in the middle of these two then it would have fit perfectly but as for this it just slides perfectly on my wrist my seven and a half inch wrist and it just sits there very very nicely and uh, yeah it's just it's very good Beautiful, beautiful G-Shock. I, I, I just, I'm so impressed with this G-Shock. Endless possibilities with this. Uh, the screw down crown uh, is amazing. I've never had that before, where I have an electronic uh, watch like this, or uh, and then you know it uses the screw down crown. That's kind of strange, but it was a little getting used to that. But awesome feature. Uh, this thing is just packed with features. So yeah oh let me show you guys what i mean with this so put it on you guys are gonna be like oh you're exaggerating so yeah it's like right there so 
like if I wear it like this, it's good, but this is too tight, so I can't even get a finger down there. And you know, during the day, your finger or your arm will swell up, and then it just becomes too tight. So I take it off and I put it one that is smaller. But then it's kind of like too too biggy, and it, it it can roll off like that to the side and stuff. More during the day, it just rolls off like that to the side. And just kind of annoying so it's like uh, the hole had to be like right in the middle but other than that it doesn't really bother me and uh, it looks badass either way really love this G-Shock but I put it down now in my uh, in my my safe my jewelry safe box and I'm rocking the GWG 2000 um, there are enough videos out there about this watch and you know the functions and uh, what all it does and the compass and everything um, I figure you know there's probably gonna be zero chance of me ever needing this to work as a as a compass but let's say hypothetically if I'm ever in a situation where I am inclined or I need to be using a compass wouldn't it be nice to have a compass and then you have it in your watch all right things that I like already said that I use or I will be using obviously uh, a lot is the alarm feature maybe timer as well for my daughter's uh, gymnastic things and training and for my own training uh, I like to put um, on this one I have a timer of 45 minutes and when I'm working out I just you know time my my uh, my, uh, my exercise so that and just the all-around ruggedness and the all-around uh, feel of durability that you have an awesome G uh, Shock Mud Master that will just you know be one hell of a beater watch uh, with the sapphire glass, carbon fiber bezel, uh, and of course solar-powered uh, battery. So you know you're not gonna run out of juice anytime soon all right guys so that is it i'm very happy with the newest g-shock acquisition and uh that'll be all for today and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out